Well, welcome or welcome back at I need help at C squared. In this example, we have a polynomial inequality and we need to find the solution set. The first thing you want to do is to set up this uh, polynomial equals to zero. And uh, in this case, we can use factoring. I'm going to have x plus 4, x plus 1 equals 0, which is going to give us the two solution, x equals negative 4, and x equals negative 1. In this moment, we can do the table, and we're going to have here the first one negative 4, the second one negative 1, for each value the function is 0, and the first one I have in my mind it's uh, to always to use is 0. And if you take that 0 and you plug it here, and uh, these two uh, factors, 0 plus 4 is a positive number, 0 plus 1 a positive number. That tells us we have a positive value of that product. Okay, well then let's take a look to a number between negative 1 and negative 4, like negative 3. And again, you can plug it in here and you, you will notice negative 3 plus 4 is a positive number, negative 3 plus 1 is a negative number, so we have a negative value for that function here. And if you do similar, you're going to notice a positive value on the left of negative 4. And now if we look back to our original problem, we need to find out when is greater or equals to 0. That's happened between negative infinity and negative 4, bracket here, and here parenthesis. And uh, negative 1 and infinity, and will be union here, in case you need that. So, yes, um, this quadratic, this polynomial is greater or equal to 0, the original problem. Uh, in those two intervals. You can see the same thing in the picture, uh, greater or equal zero. Yes, this is the piece, and this is the piece also when it's greater or equal zero. If you enjoyed this video clip, don't forget to click the like button and come back on C-square for more help. Thank you.